Hello everyone. Let's try to learn four set Venn diagrams now. In the previous videos, we have learned everything about two set and three set Venn diagrams. We learned how to find a particular region according to the statement given in the questions. So similarly like that, we'll also have four set Venn diagrams. So a four set Venn diagram is basically represented like this. If there's a universal set outside this, then it will be like this will include all these four sets in the universal set. So it is very easy to mark the regions. Let us try to find out which region includes A, B, C, D, only A, only B and all those things. So this is the set that represents A, this whole block from here to here. Similarly, we have B, C and D also. So let us try to find out which all regions in this diagram have A. So this will have A, this will also have A, A will be here and in all these regions A will be present. So we have taken all the regions wherever A is present. Now let us take the regions where B is present. So B will be present here, B will also be present here, here also in this region also and in this region also apart from that B will also be here here and here similarly for region C C will be here C will be here also C will be present in all these boxes I hope you can easily see it so we are done with A with B with C so let us finally mark all the regions where D is present so D will be present here, D will be present here, here, here also, here also in this region, this region and in this region. Now we have taken all the regions, we have covered all the regions and we have also mentioned all the areas where A, B, C, D are present. So if we look into this particular region, this means that it is the region of only A. This is the region of only B. This region over here, it includes both A and B. This region includes A and C. This region is for A and B and C. This is for B and C. This is for only C. This region is for A and C and D. This is the intersection of all four regions. So A, B, C, D. This is the intersection of three regions which are B, C and D. This is the intersection of two regions C and D. This is the intersection of A and D. This region represents ABD. This region represents BD. And this region represents only D. Now if I put a universal set outside these four sets, then this region which is outside these four sets, this will be not A, not B, not C and not D. This big set will be the universal set over here. So let us mark all the regions which represent only one or exactly one. Those will be this region, this region, this region and this region. If we mark regions which represent exactly two then we have this region, this region, this region, this region, this region and this region over here. So all these are the regions that represent exactly two. If we talk about regions that represent exactly 3 then we have this region over here, this region, this region, this region and finally we have only one region which represents all 4 and it is over here. This is the region representing all 4. So there are 4 regions of exactly 1, there are 6 regions of exactly 2 there are 4 regions which represent exactly 3 and there is only one region which represents all 4 or exactly 4 so I hope you understood the basics of 4 set Venn diagrams whenever you get a question based upon 4 attributes then you always have to draw this diagram and put the values in the regions accordingly if there is any doubt you can comment below thank you